Hello, today I'm going to be doing a review of the Shogun RDA from Vapors Cloud. Uh, it's currently, I've seen it available for £40, but I have seen it for as little as £35. I picked this up at Vapor Expo in October and paid £35 for it. Uh, it is a 22mm squonking RDA. Uh, it also comes with a beauty ring, which can put it out to 24 uh, it comes with two different airflow clap caps, and I'll show those in a bit. Uh, and it is 510 drip tip compatible. Okay, so let's go through what you get inside the bag. Uh, you get a bag of spares. You get two top caps with this, which I think is very good. You get a slightly more open airflow drip tip and a more restricted airflow cap, not drip tip, cap. Um, which is the one I've mainly been using because I prefer it slightly more restricted. You get a, a beauty ring, a very low profile, so so low profile you can hardly see it with my fingers, very low profile 510 drip tip there, um, but any drip tip will fit into it, so that's not a problem at all, and the deck. Right, so let's take a quick look at the deck. Um, so basically you've got on the side there you can see there you've got your little notch to put your coiling rod in when you're coiling it the grub screws and the holes for your coils are very big i've had no problem getting um, claptons in there or anything you can fit anything pretty much any any size coil you want in there and it is a Space nice wide between screws inside the deck to put your coil in and it is quite a nice deep um juice well and the thing also thing I like about it as well is that the squonk pin is flush with the bottom of the deck so when you're squonking it will take out all of the juice um, that isn't being used so it's it, it's very good and it's very difficult to over squonk this right on to the pros and cons uh, the pros are it's very easy to build on um, it's very good flavor it's a very smooth airflow uh, I, the one thing I like about the version that I have is with the clear cap uh, the clear cap makes it easy very easy to see when you're squonking uh, it's a very well overall well designed and tight little package um, so, yeah, so there's the, the, that's the pro side from the cons it's it's not really a con because I think how this is designed is you don't shouldn't need to adjust the airflow but the fact that it isn't you can't really adjust the airflow with with either of the caps um, I think you'd have to put that down as a con it doesn't bother me it hasn't affected the way i've vaped it. it hasn't affected my enjoyment of it but you just if you need to put something in the con side of it you could put that one but i don't think it's a huge detriment to the rda but it could be seen as a con by some people right so in conclusion um would i recommend it to somebody to buy uh certainly yes i would uh it's it's a very good other rda uh, if you're a fan of single coil RDAs with a restricted lung hit, this is definitely worth a look. Um, I think it's it's very easy to use, very easy to call, very easy to wick. Um, and, and in my opinion, I think it's quite stylish. Uh, the fact that it comes with the, in the clear capped version, which is the one that I bought, I think is is very good and, and quite unusual for RDAs that are in this price range. I mean, you know, you've got to remember it's, it's £40, so it's not as cheap as the D Pro Mini, but it's nowhere near. You wouldn't exactly call this a, a, a high-end costing RDA and for, for, for what you get with it and for the quality of the vape from it, um, I think it's a, it's a real bargain at that price. Um, I said with, with the design of it, I said it's, it's as flavoursome as the, D, as the D Pro Mini without being you know, quite as hot and spitty as, as, as the D Pro Mini can be or I find it sometimes. So yes, and I would certainly recommend people in interested in this RDA to, to, to go out, pick one out and give it a try because it's, it, it's very well made and it works extremely well. So that kind of covers everything. Um, thanks for watching the video and I hope to see you next time.